This tutorial explains how to get the frequency of words in a character string using the R programming language. So without too much talk, let's dive into the R code. In this video I will show you an example and this example is based on the character string that we can create with line 3 of the code. So if you run this line of code you can see at the top right of our studio that a new character string is appearing which is called x. And we can print this character string to the bottom in the RStudio console by running line 4 of the code. And then you can see at the bottom that our character string contains the words hello, yay, hello, what is going on, going on, on. So let's assume that we want to count the different words in our character string and return the frequency of each of the words. Then we can apply the code that you can see in lines 7 and 8. So in these lines of code I'm using the sort function, the table function, the unlist function and the stress split function and I'm specifying that I want to sort our values in decreasing order. And the output of this is then stored in a new data object which I'm calling freak x. So if we run lines 7 and 8 of the code a new data object is appearing at the top right which is called freak x. And we can print this data object to the bottom in the RStudio console by running line 9 of the code. And then you can see that we have created a table. And this table shows in the table names the words in our data. And then the values below these words show the frequencies of each word. So for instance, the word on is appearing three times in our character string. That's all I wanted to explain in this video. In case you want to learn more on this topic, you may check out my homepage statisticsglobe.com because on my homepage I have recently published a tutorial in which I'm explaining the content of this video in some more detail. I will put a link to this tutorial into the description of the video so you can find it there. If you have liked this video or if you have any questions, let me know in the comments section below. I'll try to respond to all comments as soon as I can. Furthermore, make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel to get notified about future video releases. I have already published about 500 videos on this channel and I'm releasing new videos on a daily basis. Thanks a lot for watching. See you in the next video.